Helldivers 2, new mission. Welcome back to another video, peeps. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to finish the new mission. Um, so as you can see, we have a new major order from the people of Super Earth. And uh, it's basically... It's basically a defend mission to be honest, so as you can see, if you want to read that, you can pause that. Uh, basically, you have to go to press this button in the beginning and then defend three silos. And every time a bug hits the silo, it becomes unstable. And if they damage it enough, you have to restart the whole thing. So, it's hard, especially on Helldive, but it's definitely doable if you bring the right stratagems. So, we'll, we'll get to it. Even I can feel it. We'll see, we'll see. Right, peeps, so the biggest tip for this one is you have to bring your defensive stratagems. They're going to be the star players of this whole operation because you need to defend the silos. Um, so, one of the problems that I had before was sometimes if you shoot the bug near the silo, you actually damage the silo, so you have to be really careful. So, the first thing you do when you get in is press that button and then you have three silos to defend it doesn't matter which one you go to really um, as you can see for this video we're going to silo number two so the thing is before even the mission starts you have to bring in the right stratagem so A4 he brought a mortar sentry gatling sentry a shield and a railgun C3 Chicharon aka Avon he brought an EMS he brought a tether tower an arc thrower and some mines S2, Saint Ven, aka Steven, he brought in an EMS, a mortar, a Gatling, and an anti tank. And to be honest, his setup's pretty much the same as mine. I had the EMS Gatling. Uh, the only difference is instead of a mortar, I had a machine gun, and I also had the expendable anti tank. So you need defensive strategy to take care of the little ones, but obviously, there's going to be chargers and battle titans, as you can see. Uh, then, honestly, I, I've been using it and it feels like it doesn't even do anything to the bad titans um, But you need stuff to deal with the big boys like that now We tried different strats before in previous games where we would Go to one area or open different silos at the same time hoping that it would spread out But it just didn't work out to be honest like you can try that strat if you want to it may work for you But for us it didn't really work um, so we just decided we'll stick together and just defend one. I mean, when you get to this point and it's 50%, and look, our silo is still stable. That's when you know you're doing well. Uh, if it's 50% and you're already unstable, as you can see there, it's unstable now. That's when you're gonna get kind of nervous. So all you need to do is when you get to that area, before you even press that button, you need to get set up. Put all your sentries down. Try and look for like a spawn point for the bugs because there's like quite a few um there's four of you so you should have enough to have to cover one each and maybe go in between and help each other out and communicate so this gameplay we obviously have a mic we're talking i have done a game where i didn't talk at all didn't really communicate with anyone and we still finished the mission i'll upload that video right after this actually look at that kill by steven thank you steven but anyway so the strat is you go in there you do all that you have to survive until it's 100 percent and after that you can move on to the next silo now another strat that we were actually doing um before this game was if you're overrun and there's way too many bugs and you know like sometimes you just know you kind of have to know when to give up what we do is we run away and run to the other silo because by the time you get there it's not empty but there's not as many bugs so that could be a strat as well if you need to run away from one silo to another you can do but this gameplay is so smooth we literally just did every silo first try bang 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 and look by the time you go to another silo and you defend it your stratagems will come back so I think this is probably the easiest and best strat to do this new mission. Um, I've failed this mission a couple of times, but I've also completed this mission a couple of times. So I've done it a couple of times already. I know what kind of works and what doesn't work. Um, but yeah, just enjoy the rest of the show. I think we're good now. 
Okay, which sides are they coming from? Let's have a look at the map. Steven's got some. There's some on this side. There's a lot on this side as well. Ah, oh, okay. I'll get these two points then. Right here. Bug tunnel breach on me. Oh, there's a lot on this side. Yeah, I know. You and A4 got that. Me and uh, Steven will get... Me and Steven will get in between. Me, me, Steven, we have the one there, you and near me. Yeah, I'm yeah. Oh, oh shit, there's a fucking... I almost Wait. died, I almost oh, died. My mind. Wait, what the fuck? It got destroyed already. I have to redo it again. Why did it get destroyed? Oh, uh, the, the chargers. They killed the, my turret. Oh, oh shit. Got you, I'm set. Wait, where did these spitters come from? I swear, I haven't seen them in ages. Watch out. Yeah. Like, these guys are bugged, they're not blue. Oh. oh, everyone, you're chilling that side. You keep that side, I'm gonna go help them out. Yes, yeah, Steven, oh, A4, we need to defend this side. Because, look, we're half right there. Steven, that's mine. Yeah, I threw it back. Hey, where did you where do you say the supply was? I'm low on ammo. Uh, it was right here, somewhere there. The charger. Oh yeah, it's under the charger. Yeah. See how much easier this is with the fucking turrets and the fucking. Cause look, we're doing really well. As long as we cover all sides, we'll be good. Hmm? Now, the biggest challenges you will have in this mission is probably the spitters. The so this is an order of from difficult to the most difficult. So spitters, chargers, and then the baltines. They're only really the biggest threats that you need to worry about. Obviously, you still have to kill bugs that are coming. Um, so I suggest. Well, I've been using the breaker. Uh, Steven's been using the breaker incendiary. Uh, that's why he has a lot of friendly fire kills. Oi, oi. Um, no, but for real, like I think the breaker, <clears throat> they gave it less ammo and gave it a bit more recoil. But honestly, it doesn't feel that much different to me. Like it still pretty much feels the same. Um, but obviously, it's not. So you need to bring in weapon that will protect you, especially because the hunters will come at you flying and. If one hits you, you're already slowed, and then you have like three or four hitting you, bang, 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 you're dead. So you need to bring in something that will get rid of them quickly, or else you'll die a lot um, in this game mode. Um, so some of the other things that we learned um, in the last game, before this one, Steven brought heavy armor, and he was doing alright with it, to be honest, but now that he's switched to a medium one, he's way more better, he can run faster, and I feel like he can cover points faster as well i mean this mission is a defense mission so it doesn't feel like you have to move a lot but you kind of do because there's different points like you see the turret i just put down there was actually a perfect spot and i didn't even mean to do it like i wasn't even thinking i just put it down um because on that turret over there there's literally like only one pathway the bugs can come and the bugs that come from there um they can't really fly so they have to walk through the path i'll show you in a bit but yeah, so at first it was just me, Aaron, and Steven trying it. I invited uh, someone that I played with before, Azera Lux, A4. Um, I played with him a couple of times, he's quite good. And um, this was our first time doing the mission with this new strat, and he joined, so I think it made it a bit easier that we had a fourth guy. But it's definitely, I think, doable with three. So as you can see here, all you need to worry about is these big boys. So I always threw down an expendable anti tank. Um, just put it down even if you don't use it because it's better to have them for when the chargers and the battle titans come um, and during the gameplay as well we would always talk on the mic like who needs help or we need to go so this century look at that boom can't even get past halfway you shall not pass now but real talk I think spreading yourselves out getting all the choke points and just talking within each other it's the only way you can 
like really really utilize this strat um, like I said it is possible to do it by not talking and just working together as a team without talking but again like if you want to finish this mission on hell dive because that's all we do baby level 50 cadets hell dive everything even automatons that's why I never have a good time with Tata against automatons but yeah so our major order now it's basically oh don't die don't die I'm about to die okay maybe not so our major order is basically um, to basically do all the silos make sure they're secure and then at the end you'll see the termicide will open up bang 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 um, and that's basically major order so we have four planets to do that for um, and then that's the major order I think for the next six days so hopefully we do it but even if we don't we'll always try you know oh is it a 40 minute mission damn We couldn't have done it without you, Azira Luke's. Sorry about your environment. So, as you can see, we started the mission. Uh, it was 40 minutes. We basically did it in 10 minutes. Like, I think that's probably the quickest time that we've done this mission in. So, as I said, once you defend all three silos, all you need to do is press that button that Aaron failed the first time to do. Um, and then, once you've done that, mission complete you press that button and then exfil will come shortly all you need to do is the fence so this is probably the easiest part especially because by the time you get here you have all your sentries again um and you just basically have to defend until you leave on the plane so on my screen you're still here oh as it looks like he was playing the same but level six now nah, bro this is level nine baby steven you're still alive bro I'm dead, bro. I'm bro, I'm telling you, when you watch this clip back, it's gonna show that you're dead. I mean, alive. Oh, your team was level Yo, six. Do you uh, send you a clip as well? Yeah, go on then. Yeah, man, we oh, always play. Really we always play hell dive, bro. That's that's where we live. Legit, I'm pressing L1 to reinforce you, and I can't. Legit. <laughs> you should send you out like. <laughs> yeah, and it says you're alive. I am dead, bro. Look on this one. Yeah, like, we don't even have the option to reinforce you right now. Legit. Oh, now you're dead. Yeah, now you're dead. There you go, I'll call you. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> that was like the longest death ever. <laughs> what happened? I didn't know we were on the cliff. <laughs> Were you trying to hit him? <laughs> I was trying to dodge him. You're behind you, Steven. I'm out of ammo, bro. Hey, I told you this was the one, didn't I? Steven, what did I say? Oh, you put that? Oh, you put that Tesla, you <laughs> Not me. <laughs> like, if I didn't have this armor, I would have died. <laughs> what are you doing? Well done, boys. We did it. We did it. That was so easy, man. Oh, hey, chill, bro. <laughs> what are you guys doing, man? Uh, I got the jukes, bro. What are you saying, G? I'm leaving. Oh shit. I'm stuck. Oh I'm shit, everyone, you're stuck. <laughs> stuck. Thank you. Oh, okay. fuck. <laughs> oh, you can still make it. You can still make it. Everyone, just go straight into the ship. You can reinforce oh, into yeah, the ship. I can, I can try. <laughs> I'm stuck. <laughs> yeah man GG's bro welcome welcome to victory
What's this special thing that you told me? What special thing? Well, you don't get any. You don't so, get any super credits for this, bro. <laughs> no, you missed it. So no, you know, just... before we exfilled, this massive thing just pumped out a bunch of pesticide and gas shit. Did you guys not see it? ETA T minus one minute and thirty seconds. Right, peeps, I just want to talk about some of the bugs and glitches I've been experiencing since the update. So, first of all, my stims don't always work. Um, my mech blows up randomly, and I've watched the clip over and over again to figure out what killed me, and sometimes I just don't know. And the weirdest one is let's say I have a shotgun, and then like a secondary, which is the one I always usually use, which is a submachine gun. Sometimes after I die, it puts you back to the Liberator and the default pistol, which is kind of annoying, but. It is what it is. So thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I can't wait for the next update because Helldivers 2 is about to get more wild with all the new stuff that they're going to release. Thank you to Aerod and Steven and Azure Lux for this video. And peace out my dudes. From the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for watching. And peace out.